This is Amigos PC. If you were looking for a highbrow, fancy, smart, regal podcast with hosts that love to talk about horse riding, badminton, and trips to the vineyard, you're in the wrong place. This is Amigos PC. If you're looking for drinking, random nonsense, stunts, shenanigans, and balls out craziness, you've hit the jackpot. This is Amigos PC, and this is Scott and Mark. All the way from Tamara. Cheers, buddy. Cheers, guys. Clink, clink, clink. Clink. All right, so here's the 30 top luxury retail stores of 2019. Because 2020, there's probably only 15. Are we going to save this for the show? Are are we recording? Yeah, we're recording already. Yeah. We're live. All right, well. Yeah. So I'm I'm Scott. That's Mark. Oh, (laughs) you're live. Albert joins us again. That's Albert. Our other I'm not amigo. joining you, motherfucker. I'm part of the team. I know. You're the other amigo. That's what I just said. <laughs> oh, oh, I need to change the intro. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, just for everyone else. And it's not Albert. It's Quantum Albert. Quantum Albert. Quantum Albert joins us. So, a little insight on whoever's listening or will listen. We had a, a scheduled show with Delvin Cox, Delvin Cox Experience. Uh, yeah. We had some technical issues probably on both ends, I would RN, say. R N, I don't know. We, it's we tried. RN. It's R N, dude. Don't, yeah, don't. it's R N. We're not gonna blame the guests. That's always our fault. Um, <laughs> it's always, it's always, it what is, is it's it always, is, it's always the it is customer's fault. always right. Yes, right. But, yeah. No, that is no? not. No. No, we're gonna roll. Give a fuck Custom- what Walmart says. Customer's always right. Walmart doesn't say that shit. Anyways, before we started, we were talking about. <laughs> I don't know why. What were we? Why are we talking about? Oh. Mark had a sticker on his clothes. Yeah, I have new shorts. He had new shorts right on. Now. So I was new like, shorts. oh, we were at new shorts. He went and bought them at some high end place. He oh, said he still got, had a sticker on? He still had a sticker yeah, on. He goes, oh, he's like, I got him at dealers. I go, wow, you're shopping at the high end place? Because I would have went to it, like. It just shows you how much I don't pay attention to like little things everything, like that. Yeah. Or, Not yeah. everything. I mean, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Yeah. I that, get clothes all the time. So I just don't pay attention to that. Yeah. That's what Mark is saying. <laughs> You know, I, I just, I just popped tags. To... I just, he literally just popped tags yeah. right now. So that's what oh, he does I, all day. I just wanted to return them, and then I realized oh, I you should have left it on. I sat them. <laughs> I just wanted to use them and return them. them. Back. <laughs> so we were talking, like, what is a high end? So he said he oh, got them yeah. at Dillard's. Yep. And I was thinking, shit, that's pretty high end. No, I didn't get them at Dillard's. Where did I get them at? I know. You did. You're, no, you no, no, here, now, here's the thing, Scott. There's a lot of high end, but which. Are you at, uh, talking about high end popular? Well, I was just thinking. So back in our day, for, for me, when I was younger, or like when you go to the mall, which of those are kind of non-existent these days, yeah. the Dillard's and like the Macy's, those were kind of like yeah, the high your, end, your higher end stuff. Or you would go to Ross, or that's your lower end. I get the stuff, right. I get the half show, half sleeve, high end, really high end. We're at Ross or at Dillard's? Yeah, at Ross. He like the gas Gucci. Yeah, with yeah. No, with no sleeve on one side. <laughs> so it was the return item or the, or yeah. the, or, or the, the, damage, the damage Defective. product? Defective. Yeah, damage. <laughs> so I was saying, so what, what is considered today like a top retail store? Right. Because I was like, I don't know. I mean, to me, Dillard's is was. Is Macy's still one of them? May, I mean, to me, those are still around. So they. They're higher up than like a what Ross man. Where do you go to get clothes? This is such a dad conversation. I know. Yeah. Anyway, so I looked up the top thirty. We'll just okay. name. Just go through like these, five. I can't. I'm not gonna name off. Just do the. Top I'm not gonna five. name all these are in Paris and London. Let's go to where oh, okay. Tokyo, London, <laughs> Tokyo. There's a place called Barrow in New York. That's number nine. Ooh, do they serve pizza? No, it's not a Barrow's. Oh, so that's another dad comment by you. <laughs> um, the bar. I don't know if Barrows <laughs> bar- bar- is around anymore. <laughs> but, but like, do they deliver? Oh, wait, Barrows is. I was thinking, I was thinking do the No, that was the mall. The <laughs> remember those? Yeah, I remember the Barrows. Yeah, uh, the Dreamery. That's in New York. Yeah, that's what I'm saying there's a lot of high end ones, 
but yeah. they're not not no, they very sound familiar to me. No. Yeah. No. All right. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. There's nothing. There's a Gucci. Tiff- yeah. No, they, that's, those, that's those are, those Gucci are Garden. Gucci Garden in, Flo- See, this in Florence. Is, this is where an episode that we need to have like an Instagram model on, and they could they could tell they us. They can. T- well, we wouldn't even know. Oh, like, good they question. Go places and we wouldn't even. Yeah. Them out. Oh, then there's that one that's down by whatever Saks. Is that one? Yeah, Saks. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't know. See, we don't know fashion. We're dudes, and yep. To us, Dillard's fashion to me is me wearing one, my. Hey, give me one stuff. second, guys. I'll be right Uh-oh. back. I gotta get what happened? a little plug in for my computer. Gotcha. Okay. I was thinking when we were talking nowadays, I would think Nord- Nordstrom's Sticks to out. me would be the, the top end. I mean, for I, me, yeah, I guess they, they still have uh, I'm, I don't a shop high, in one, you know, they probably still carry Ralph Lauren and all that stuff. Let's see what Dillard's. Oh, yeah, Dillard says, huh? I don't know, I don't go to the fucking mall. <laughs> yeah, yeah, see, yeah, I know. <laughs> Malls and are is, unfortunately and is, dead. And going to the mall, like, is that even high end still? Like, maybe that's mid level. Like, we're not even near high end. So you're you're high end when you go to like boutiques. Yeah, yeah. So top ten. I don't even want to get into the top ten yeah. Scottsdale boutiques here. Are what? Number one is Objects. Uh, Swankies. Swank. Yeah, Swankies. Objects kind of sound like Rocket. Rocket Go Go. Objects sound pretty sexist if you think about it. Yeah, I want to go to the website. It's provocative. Yeah, that one's on Scottsdale oh, that, Road. That's we could talk about that briefly. What's that? Um, I don't know if you guys if you knew this. Oh, Macy's is on the list. Is it? Well, yeah. I mean, I guess I don't know. They they do hold a parade every year in New York. They do the Macy's Day Thanksgiving Parade. That will be 2021. Yeah. That will not be happening this year. Definitely not this year. This year gets a pass. It's going to be an asterisk in the fucking calendars. Hey, ladies. How you doing? Hey, where'd you go? <laughs> We're just waiting for you. We just sat here in silence until you came Yeah, out. I'm sure you guys did. Dead yeah. air. Dead air. Dead air. Yeah, sure. <laughs> you got, have you guys uh, checked out the uh, lineup on Netflix recently or no? Like this past what do you weekend, mean, top, like a top ten. Uh, yeah. maybe, I don't know. Just, it, you know what? I'm, like to see what's going on. Yeah, there's one that I'm watching right now. Actually, is uh, and I don't know. I don't know if I. It's, uh, do you guys remember that guy that uh, that was for, with the gymnastics? Oh, yeah, did you know? Louis, not, Louis, not, Louis, uh, something the star. No, it's it's Nashu or Nasa. That yeah, one. Yeah, Nashu. Uh, something the star. I'm watching yeah. it right now. The doctor. It's, it's a documentary. Yeah, the documentary. Yeah, I yeah. want to see it, but I had to be in the right mindset, kind of like an yeah. situation. Yeah, it's uh, I have to be like a. You know, it's not, it's, not a, it's, uh, it's not as. It's not as. How do I say it? And not, not in a bad way. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're like, like, not as good as the F team. Yeah, it's almost it's about? almost over, and it doesn't it doesn't it's not it's uh, it's about everything, but it's more about the girls' gymnastics stuff than. Then mostly the, what the damage that took place? Yeah, it's called. Uh, I forgot what it's called. No, it's, I know what you're talking about. That's like the top one right now. Like the the oh, it is okay. Yeah, when you first bring up Netflix for me. It pops up the gymnastic thing, and it's like makes you want to try to check it out. And I was like, oh, yeah. I do want to know the story, but I have. Do, do you have your own account? Do you guys have your own account? Like, and then no, I, I take it from family members. I do. I have my own account. Family, actually, family members take it from me. Not that you pay for it. Oh, like yeah. Your so own, I have mine. Your I have own mine. Avatar. Yeah, yeah. Your you own have, avatar. A kid's yeah. one. Okay. Then I have a, my other two kids, Josh and Evan. So they have their own. So they can watch their own stuff. But weirdly enough, in mine. They watch the same stuff I do. I think they go into my stuff. <laughs> whether I see stuff that has been watched, <laughs> we haven't watched, or maybe we have never starting it up. They log, in, they log into yours. Maybe. Yeah. They click on your avatar. I have it password protected, so they can't watch anything too crazy. Yeah. Except for Josh, he can, because I figure he's old enough. If he wants to watch some craziness, he could. Yeah. He's already 18, right? Yeah. 19. 19, yeah. Last night, I watched uh, Will Farrow's new movie. Oh, 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 I haven't seen that one. I saw I saw. Hey, is, it a, hey, is it a musical? 80% of it. 80% of it. It is okay. kind of a musical. It is kind of a musical. It is kind of a musical, yeah. Is it good? Um, I enjoyed it. Did you? Yeah, wow. I did. Oh, did you? Uh, so I far, you didn't, you, didn't, 
Mark, you didn't you didn't sound too convincing. No, I did. I didn't. No. Okay, how many how many marks? You're, like, how many, you're, you're, you're like, uh, I enjoyed it. I'm like, it like, yeah. how, how many mark stars do you give it? Three. Three out of uh, five. Out of ten. <laughs> Three out of five. Yeah, because you're like, uh, I enjoyed it. That means that there, it was all right. Okay, yeah. Tell me, tell me your thoughts. The movie itself reminds me of Will Ferrell when he was on Saturday Night Live with oh. the superstar chick. When they were the, when they were the musical people yeah, doing, yes. yeah, yep. Okay. It reminds me of that, and I kind of wish that she was in this. Molly, to, Molly Shannon, I think so. Yeah. Instead oh, really? of, yeah, Instead like of what's her name? Yeah, she for she's me pretty the chick that they have. Yeah, oh yeah, she, yeah. But Rachel That's McAdams, what, that, for Rachel me, McAdams, yeah. yeah. I think that would have made the movie that much, like that, that would have been more. Yeah, I would agree. I'd have been like, oh my god, this because is fucking hilarious. But I don't think of Rachel McAdams as being very comedic and like she's not funny. Yeah, she's not. Yeah, she, you well, don't she's, think not of a, it. she's not a comedian. I know either, that's what so I mean. That's another, I, mean, I don't know if Will Ferrell would consider himself a comedian either. He's, he's just a funny actor. Well, I would, yeah, I mean, no matter, I, would, yeah, I guess they're saying um, improv. Yeah, okay, you don't need to okay. be a comedian. Have you ever heard or seen him do stand up? No, I don't think he does stand up. A comedian? Okay, a comedic actor? Is that yeah, what you're going to say? Yeah, that's what he's talking about. That's what you're going to put him okay, as? That's, okay. not, that's not what she is, yeah, I don't think. I would agree. Um, It, ha- it has. At the moment? Like, there's, no, it, yes, it does have its moments it where it's yeah. pretty fucking hilarious. Um, But there, there are like. There are well, a couple. Lines within this movie, if that makes sense. A couple what? Like a couple storylines. Like there's the storyline oh. of them with Eurovision, right? And then there's a storyline of them as a couple, which it kind of gets girly. But, um, and then there's like a there, there's like an offshoot of something that they believe in. That I'm not, I'm not trying not to ruin the movie for yeah, you. Yeah, don't don't. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll watch it tonight, and we'll we can discuss it the next episode. Okay, I, I'm gonna watch it tonight. I'll watch it tonight because I've been wanting to watch it. It's worth so. Seeing. I'm almost done with that uh, list A, the one with the. I, I the will star. say that they do shit on Americans, and it's fucking hilarious. <laughs> All right, don't tell me no more. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I, I'm gonna watch it. I, I, I'm gonna watch it right now after yeah. this. No, just for that, Mark. So my my take on it. I've seen, like I said, eighty percent of it. Okay. So, yeah, I put you. On, put so on what do you, th- you think, Scott? My thing is. Oh, there you go. See, that's the issue right there. It's not funny. My thing. One thing. My is, thing I, is. <laughs> I noticed that it almost seemed like his formula is always like he's trying to in his movies. I'm trying to. I'm kind of putting a pattern together where it's almost like he's. He always wants to sing, huh? Well, I don't, I don't mind that, but I, I think that he's always trying to like get over on his dad. He almost, it's almost like a dad issue kind of thing, where he's, he's trying got to daddy issues. It almost seems that's right in that way. I mean, step brothers. <laughs> right, he's always to be better than what he is. Is even in well, I guess he was. What was it? Uh, yeah, but it was. Mom, is he, is that light back there too bright? No, you're Wait, looking. That's no. good. It's good now. Okay. Just shining off your head. I just, I, I was just, I was putting that together. So watching it. No, Mr. Clean over there and shit. <laughs> it's got funny moments. It's worth watching. Okay, but okay. I'll watch it tonight, so we can discuss on discuss. Discuss it fully next episode. Yeah, it's tell not, us, it's, you can tell us how much you hate it. It's not as bad. Mm. That's what I gotta say. Mm. We'll see. Okay, I'll see. I'll uh, I'll give my opinion next week. Yeah. So, so what do you think about the uh, the other show that you're watching? You just the like I said, I thought it was gonna be a little bit more into detail of the shit that he was doing and all that. They don't. They just touch on that. No, it's just more, I, how, no how, it's not that they they. they, they <laughs> no, it's a it's, it's a, the whole thing is about the whole, not just Nassar, but the whole company oh, itself. The cover up, right? Yeah, and, oh, and the company and the company, the Olympics covering up. Yeah, the Olympics and the, that that company that did you know because they talked a little bit about you know uh, Mary Lou Retton, that chick okay. from nineteen seventy six that ever since then ever since she won from in nineteen seventy six. She was 14 years old, so that's when, actually, right before that, a lot of the gymnasts were, like, in the tw- early, in the 20s, 30s and shit. Then this girl comes in, uh, uh, Nadia Kamanachi. 
1976. She's 14 years old and she wins the gold medal. After that, now it's more little girls that want to be gymnasts. That's when that, all that issue starts becoming a bigger like issue. A whole, whole yeah. Ring. Before that, it was all you know the girl, the the gymnast girls were all in their twenties, thirties already. So, so once they younger, once they got younger, they got more. Yeah, it, it got worse they, because they got, now, because you can, yeah, you can do now things. Not, yes, exactly. It, it turns into a pedophile type. Yeah, thing. exactly. And then it starts from there, and then it goes into. It is about this situation with the SAR. And everything, but uh, it's you know it does talk about a lot of different points of it. So wow. it's not just uh, out, again. Yeah. You have to it's all right. It's it's, a, it's all right for that. I don't think that's a good mindset you need to be in. Not not you don't okay you don't yeah, want to be no, in a you don't have to, you don't no it's not about mindset. being in a, in a certain mindset. It's you just look at things. like when we, like you said when you were when we were watching. I mean, when, I, I'll be honest, dude. When we, I when I watched, I think I watched it before you guys, the uh, Epstein, or maybe me and Scott watched it um, at the same yeah, time. I watched, yeah, I watched it. We all finished. I binged it in one right? fucking day. Yeah, you, yeah, me too. I be, I binged it in one. Yeah, I binged it in one day too. Took me a couple days to do it. I was in a I, bad mindset. I binged it in one day too, but hmm. I, I didn't see what you guys are seeing that you have to be in a certain mindset. Like to what? me, I just because to me, I just watched it and it was like, oh shit, that's fucked up. Yeah, well, I, I, I mean, cause it's normally like sometimes I'm in moods where I just want to laugh and like watch funny things. You know, that's not a funny like if I'm not in a funny mood. Oh, get, oh, I get that. Okay, I get you. But I get you. if I want to watch a documentary, then I'll be in a documentary mode, and that's what I was yeah, that day. Yeah. Like, binge the whole fucking yeah. thing. Because I started watching this one with the star last night, and I was like, oh, I crashed out, and then I was like, oh, let me finish watching it today. And, and I, I and I, the Epstein one, like I watched the first one, and it kind of, it kind of kept me. Intrigued to like want to see more and more yeah. and more. It's crazy. I kind oh, of like, I, oh, but Mark, you finished watching it already, oh, right? Yep. Yeah. What do yeah. you think? Yeah. Fucked up, right? It, yeah, it is fucked up. Uh, the the people that were taken advantage of when they were young, like that, the recruiters, it's, it's the recruiters genuine, or the yeah. Well, I mean, they were both taken sides. advantage, and they were yeah, exactly both sides. It's, it, it's definitely the the diff. Definition of multi-level marketing. It's a Ponzi scheme of sex trafficking. Yes, exactly. However, this is going to be very like if someone ever catches this ten years from now and fucking, oh, you're going to be in trouble ten yeah. years from now. Albert, go on okay. time. Okay, go on let, time let, let me hold on. Let me log out. Yeah, time. Let me log out, me log out for a little bit. You got to go 88 miles in time travel. Then, yeah. That way we can at least edit. We can at least edit it so to like I never came into it afterwards. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> As he licks the rim. The rim. <laughs> stop it. Stop it. Okay. Fuck you guys. Talking about Jeff. Yeah. Yeah. You can't lick it. Look at the salt. Yeah. <laughs> you like the, the, the one that was old enough, was of age when she got involved. The redhead? There's Yeah, there's only that one. The one that she was, she was from like uh, I forgot where it was. She was from. But. Yeah, I, 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 I think no, she she had some type of fucking accent and everything. Yeah, yeah she was from somewhere else. Yeah, she was oh, like. Um, oh, who are you talking yeah. about? The one in New York that he met. This is she, gonna. This is gonna. No, sound I think, so he awful, took her to the island. Yeah. That one. She yeah, I think he took her almost everywhere. Yeah, not not the blonde, but the other one, the redhead, the one yeah. he met. Yeah, I think she was just being naive. I think she wanted air, like not want. She that's wanted the, a relationship. No, she, she not a relationship. You don't she, think so? No, she was down to party. She was enjoying the ride. Yeah, until it wasn't a ride, and then it got weird. Well, I mean, at the end of the day, no matter what, I mean, I, I, for me, I'll be honest. I mean, even at eighteen, you're still stupid. Yeah. No, you I. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it sucks that at eighteen you're you're of legal age, but yeah. at the same time. You go back and think about when you were eighteen and what the fuck you were doing. He's oh, like, God. "There's no fuck. You, you were naive." Here's a good question: When do you think that you actually became not naive? Let me like, like twenty five, twenty six. Yeah, twenty five, twenty six. Twenties. Yeah, mid twenties. Mid twenties. I mean, even, kinda, even though then I was still kind of yeah, partying, yeah. but you know, it's different for everybody. But I think at that age is when you should be like, okay, now you're like, okay, now you don't know. Now you you should be knowing what you're doing. 25, 26, you know, at that age. 
Yeah, I would agree. Because at 18, dude, honestly, man, it's like, it, it, I mean, didn't, didn't the law just you change? Like, yeah. Well, no, not even, even, not, even at 18, not, not even at 18 now, you can't buy cigarettes anymore. That's true. Is you it 21, 21 now? Yeah. Yeah, 21 now. So it's like, he, even at, at 18, it's like, I mean, and when you think about it and you go back and you think, what the hell were you doing at 18? Fuck. Yeah. Fuck. I wasn't, it, it, it was like, fuck. And here's what I'm not saying about that situation. It's that she was naive and, and enjoying the ride until it wasn't fun. And yeah. he did over step his boundaries. Yeah. But well, any t- he did. He did take advantage of the situation, but he mm-hmm. went, you know, he, he went as far as he could go until she felt it was not okay anymore. Okay anymore. She bailed. Yeah. yeah. But that that was on somebody that was already yeah, but that old. that was his. Yeah, 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 that yeah, was yeah. that was that was his um his mo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he pushed you, and if you if you went away, he took then, it to the limits and and seen how far he could go past the limit. Which is that, why, which is why the one with the Prince Andrews, yeah, she oh, stuck oh, around. Well, Nothing the, out. The redhead is not the one that no, that was another one. That she was in New York. Went she to, like, she started went dating somewhere her. and married somebody. And said, "Fuck you." Didn't marry him, but she was like uh, he. He no, they did marry, didn't they? I don't think they got married. Who? Well, that was the whole thing of her Not staying Dick there, Prince Edwards or whatever. Oh, she did marry somebody in Australia, but that was yeah, after Australia. Australia. That's yeah. when. That's when she she cut ties and the, ran that away. Was love her. Yeah, like, she, cut, yeah, she cut, ran away and figured out like this isn't the life for me. Yeah, or you know, she, oh, she figured out what the fuck his fucking thing was. You have so much power that you think you have the audacity to say, like, well, yeah, I know that's me in a picture, but I I don't I don't recall that. I don't remember meeting her. Yeah, motherfucker. Dude, when they were interviewing him and he was like, Are you serious? I was like, Motherfucker, yeah, they're serious. Like he was acting like he had not done nothing wrong. Yeah, I wasn't there. That wasn't yeah. me. But yeah, I was like picture of are you, yes. Oh my god. I, and then I, also that that prince, uh, the so not the prince, but he's kind of like the Duke of York. Yeah, yeah, that's him. That guy, that that's guy, him. yeah, that, that's the guy that was like. I wonder how that. old he was. You think he was like thirty or something? That's Probably. the one that you're saying that he was saying that, right? Yeah. That's still fucking was, dumb. Like, don't take pictures. He, he was like, well, dude, I don't know. You should know better. He's like, dude, they t- got pictures of you. Well, I don't know. I don't remember. Like, you get the fuck out of here. That means he was on something, probably, or yeah. Or, yeah. Uh, fuck no. He was there. He was there. It just, it's just wor- it's worse to say yes, that's me. It is. So yeah, that's, you just say I, I don't know. Because recall. at the end of the day, yeah, if you say you don't Here recall, you don't remember. The yeah. Right. So what what did you say? What did you say? I, yeah, that's me. Did have sexual relations? Did I have sexual relations? <laughs> what did you say? Yes, the that's Brooklyn. me. You're fucked. Yeah. I right? not have sexual <laughs> with that woman. <laughs> and perfect perfect yeah. example. Perfect example. Yep. Of deny, deny, deny. Oh, and then what about that? What about the, what about the Bill Clinton stuff? I mean, he was all over there. He's been too. there. He that that's been documented. He's been at that place seventeen times. Wow. Damn! 17. You're gonna tell does me that doc- that hey, one- does, the docu- does the documentary say that? No, no, that was something you did. Mark, with county. Mark no, went. Yeah. Mark watched it twice in county. Mark went above and beyond, like his, <laughs> like like what he does for his clients. Mark went to the went to the island. I did some Twitter research. <laughs> and, uh, sampled, sampled, <laughs> <From> Twitter. <laughs> Mark, Mark did I, just, I did do some I, Twitter research. No, but I, I mean, I, I, he's been there multiple times. It's clear. Yes, he has. It is. I mean, yeah. And and you remember he at the I, beginning he denied it. Yeah, I know. And, and that, I, I've never been there. He hasn't been the most faithful guy. Yeah. In his no. Past. No, he hasn't. I'm sure, he dabbled out of the seventeen or three times or one time he's been there. <laughs> he's done something at yeah, least one exactly with somebody there at least. Fuck yeah. Oh no, I don't want to say that. At that time, was I wonder <laughs> if he was the president or was the next president? I wonder. When he was there? When he was going. Oh, he had to be an ex. He probably still fucking goes there, dude. Jeffrey Epstein's still alive. Uh, you oh. think so? Oh, my yeah. God, dude. What uh, do you, I don't know what about do that. But, uh, but, uh, but uh, 
Trump, I wouldn't. Put it, I also, would not. not. Well, how did uh, Trump did uh, claim that he didn't talk to him anymore for a long time, supposedly? Well. Well, it's funny I don't that believe that fucking whatsoever. It's, it's, yeah, yeah. He, he said that. He said that. He's like, oh yeah, it's, it's been like ten years since I last, last spoke to him. We're not in good terms. It's what funny. They just they, they he said the same shit about the Ku Klux Klan member. And they they got rid of the uh, attorney general that was going after the estate of Epstein. Mm-hmm. Really? They had him fired in New York. Yep. Oh shit. So it's like it's kind of a cover up after a cover up. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You're alive. The, up. How, how big? How, how big is the light gonna get? You know what I'm saying? How big is the light gonna get? I don't know. Watching that documentary, it got pretty big. Yeah, it did. Yeah, here's with the, them he, hit, hey, dude, getting it, away it, with. It's crazy, hey, dude, with this documentary, it's crazy like, that he almost got away with it, huh? Yeah, twice. Twice. More. Yeah, like, more than once. I was like. But there was one time that, that nobody knew no, nobody knew okay. about it that he was accepting a uh, not a, a kind, of, a kind of like a plea I guess or accepting yeah. you know what I'm saying and it's like oh shit nobody knows about Secret it like, yeah and it's like fuck he really knows people way up there to allow him to do that shit yeah well, what was that guy that he was uh, what was he that was he the DA of New York or something. No, the guy was in Florida. He was like the he was like the DA in Florida, the in one who Florida. got the agreement. And he, then he, he and later on he went first yeah. one, and, and he then, became Trump's right hand man. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And, yeah. and then he quit, and then he resigned or whatever because it's it streamed up again. Yeah, yeah, motherfucker. You know what the biggest mystery is though? What's and that? I know they kind of showed us a, a screen cap of like just some written down assets that Epstein had. But there's no real evidence as to what he really, he where his net worth was. Oh, his net worth. It was yeah. 500 million, but who knows what it really was. No, it was more than that. That that, sh- that sheet at the near the end of the documentary showed 5 billion in, in one particular asset. Oh, I don't remember that part. Yeah. I don't remember that part either. So it, really? it, yeah, I think it's I think it is the very last one, the fourth episode or, or it, there is yeah. going over, you know, talking about how the, the girls aren't they never get justice because he transferred all his assets to some somebody or someone else. Some trust or something. Yeah. Hey, and dude, shit like that. I mean shit like that, they that's should enough, be, money, that's enough they, money to get away from prison. <laughs> Well, and another thing, I mean, shit like that. When when you get committed like that and shit like that happens, you they should be able to just say, "Nope, that's it. You lose all your money. That's you true. can't you can't give it to anybody okay. else or nothing." You, you say that you say that, Albert. But what if you're the guy that was out partying with him and he took pictures of you with half naked underage chicks, and he has those but pictures? That's the thing. I wouldn't put myself in that situation. <laughs> yeah, I know. you know we're friends, right? <laughs> Yeah, no, but that's what I'm saying. Yeah, you would not think it's that. Like, and the, re- the reason I say drink, this, the reason I having a good time. No, but the reason I say the reason I say it is because I wouldn't put myself in that. Situation. I know none of us would. Yeah, so, would. yeah. so it's like, that's why I say fuck that. The bus stops. You're at a school zone, right? Oh, you're in the party oh, bus, God, and then that happens, and that's, he's got his <laughs> no. camera crew there, and you're just drinking. Oh man, how old are these ladies? I don't. Man, I don't know. This is fun, right? And, you, and, he, and, he, and that's how he gets the dirt on you. And then he uh, has that almost ever sounds like how we started this podcast. That's exactly <laughs> what we got. that's how we got Albert to come back. We took him to a school. We were drinking. Yeah. Someone else running. was driving. Yeah, he was running a marathon. I, I'm over there choking my we monkey. Were, right we were at the Olympics. Choking, choking Olympics. my monkey. Right there, you see my little monkey right there? <laughs> no, I don't oh, see wait, monkey. That's a weird. Mo- what? Are you, what? I'm gonna, what I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go choke him right now. What? <laughs> that looks weird as fuck. <laughs> Mark, what are you laughing at, bro? That looks weird, dude. <laughs> the fact that we're talking about Epstein and his documentary, and then you're like, "I'm gonna go choke my monkey." <laughs> In the background over there, I didn't oh realize God, that he's is- staring at us. I right know. Now, dude. I'm gonna look oh. scary, dude. You're gonna be choke. Yeah. He looks scary, dude. Fan base. 
I mean, what's that? Who has who have not seen this needs to see it. Oh, yeah. the Jeff yeah, documentary. It shows you how corrupt everything is. Big time, dude. It shows you how big time that fucking shit is corrupt, dude. It's insane. All right. man. Jumping into our next segment. Oh, segue. I was. Um, oh, we got segments here. <laughs> <laughs> um yeah a new segment not a new segment sorry um jumping into new, new topic. Conspiracy. Ooh, so i like it what happened the other day so i'm gonna tell you okay. on, a, on a personal level i was at home <laughs> I, was at home. I was at home because everyone's at home these days i was at home and me and the wife we were talking government talk not like anything crazy <laughs> but we're talking about government talk, right we were talking talking about, talk. okay okay we're, Nothing crazy. We were just talking about government views and this and that, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then all of a sudden, I go, nah, "Sorry," right? And I'm thinking, N- like that's that's it. I just said something at the end. I said, "Sorry." Yeah. And then all of a sudden, my Alexa kicks on and said, "Hey, what were, what were you saying?" <laughs> Are you serious? And then I said to Kelly, "I go, oh well, she thought I said Siri, and she goes, but that's Alexa." Oh, Alexa, I mean, Alexa, can't you know, Siri. Yeah, Alexa yeah. should have been like that. Should have been close to Alexa, not Siri. You, so you uh, said, I'm really talking, "Yeah, sorry." I go, ah, sorry. And then, that and then, and sound then, like Alexa at, at all? all. No, at all. She, no, at and all. And then, and then I was like, and then I asked her later, I "Go, Alexa, what what did I say to you?" And she was, "I'm sorry, an hour has passed." You should, I can't check your app. <laughs> you should check your Alexa app and see what you asked. And I'm like, so she just fucking covered it up. In this yeah. Fucking okay, Alexa's, a, Alexa, like, Alexa's, okay. Another Ep- Alexa's another Alexa's another Epstein. Dude. I'm gonna unplug you, and I'm gonna fucking put my hand <laughs> and walk away. <laughs> Alexa's weird. another Epstein. <laughs> yeah. no, tell, tell me this. The like, context of the government talk. Yeah. I don't, I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember. All right. Because it was late at night. And there was drinks involved and whatnot, and, and I don't remember, but but it was something government related, so it was like kind of weird that she would chime up because we have one in the bathroom in our master. There's a bat. There's a bathroom one that we play music and shit on. Oh, so yeah. that one lit up, and she's like, "Oh well, yeah, what can I help you with?" And that was like, we weren't even talking to you, but we were talking why, about why, something. Why do you have all all of them? What do you mean? Because you, you have the Apple one, right? So Siri's Well, somewhere. that's on my phone. Oh, that's just on your my phone. My phone, yeah. I don't have it. Okay, and then you have Alexa, right? And uh, you that's have, all like, I have. Is, no, that's all I have. Oh, you only have Alexa. I only have Alexa. I have two Alexas. That's it. Okay. And so well, that's it? Yeah, one in the bathroom, thought, one in the I thought, kitchen. I thought you had the Google one. Did you not? No, I didn't get the Google one. How are you? I, just got the Google I, one, I hear right? the Google one's better. Oh, I don't have the Google one. I hear, the Google, have, I hear the Google one's better. I have Alexa. Oh, George just got. Oh, George got the Google one? Yeah, because he signed up for uh, Prime Spotify. Oh, okay. Oh, I got Spotify. So you get a uh, Google Alexa with that? I yeah. Mean, a Google, they, had, uh, they had a promotion going on not that long ago where you, if you signed up uh, for their the Prime part, you know. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah. The premium, they would give you uh, the Google, the, the home drone oh, thing. Oh, okay. Gotcha. <laughs> cool. Don't we have like two Alexas at the office? We have one. Yeah. yeah. And it's not plugged in. Yeah. Smart. And it still, and it still talks to us. Yeah, it still talks <laughs> to us randomly. Right when the internet goes out for some reason. <laughs> hey guys, you trying to do something? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right next door. Yeah, next door no, the what, internet's not down yet. What government agencies are you at? <laughs> None. I don't trust them, but I have them. Good, Godzilla. Say this. Do not ever get fucking CenturyLink internet. It's the worst. It is the worst. I've been saying that for years. Yeah, it is. Fuck that. Next, next building that we move into, next office space. It's got to have Cox. We get Cox the, the or next, we don't. The next office space, you should have your own ability to get your own internet. Yeah. Not, not a, or at least not if a they provide venture. something. You know? oh. Yeah, if they provide it, it'd be Cox. Yeah, agreed. Cox and vaginas. Cox and vaginas. <laughs> we definitely have to find a different one. So vaginas okay. is the uh... archive.org is still listening to the amigos. If anybody wants to wow, chime in to that. Yeah. Who oh knows? shit. We are gonna get reamed after all these past two episodes. Maybe that's why they yeah. listen to me. Jeffrey Epstein and fucking yeah. Scott talking. Go, 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 what was it? 
conspiraciones. Oh, yeah. it's a Spanish. That, that episode got so many views on YouTube. It was insane. Which one? The, the minute conspiracy I, one? Dude, like the minute I dropped it almost, it was like constant volume for a little bit. Well, you got to think about it. Right now, there's so many people that are doing conspiracy I'm, stuff and yeah. think there's something going on. Yeah. yeah. So you, what I'm doing. Do though is is because we use the, Sp- the Spanish lingo for it. Yeah, I think so too. I think it's because we use the Spanish lingo for what uh, what do you do? You like a, a SAT, yeah. so ignorant, translated to Spanish. I- ignorant uh, conspiracy. No, Albert just told me how to spell it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, smart. <laughs> Very fucking smart. So it was. It was either. It was probably slang. So it's they not. Thought it was something it's else. Not a Googleable term. This isn't. This isn't. Yeah, no, so, it was, it joke, was the correct spelling. You fuck. Smack, no, I know your... it was the correct spelling. I'm just oh, saying, like, okay, it's not something that like Google would, uh, you know, auto translate for you. You know, like it's oh, it's not. Yeah, 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 you know, yeah, yeah. The language has its own. If you're in one region, it's something. If you're in another region, yeah, it's something. It's yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, kind of here, like redneck terms get fucking varied left and right in the United States. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, news means something different in the Bible Belt than it does let's, here. Let's let's, <laughs> let's let's step away from that. <laughs> let's put a pin in that one for later. Yeah, well, we we need. Well, we'll talk about that one when things calm down, <laughs> <laughs> which is with a lot of our topics. Epstein, yeah. crazy enough, is Epstein is safe to talk about? That's that is isn't that sad? Crazy. Isn't that sad? Epstein is safe to talk about. So, Mark, you're saying you think he's alive? That's a good conspiracy. I think he I is. Yeah, that's a good conspiracy. If Mark, if Mark's financial records are right, if he had $5 million, don't you think your life would be safe? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Let's get $5 Okay. So, hey, dude, so let me ask you this. So, so, uh, 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 so let's say he had $5 billion. $5 I don't think, I, I don't think, think this guy had a family, huh? No, because he was. Yeah. So was, I wonder who that, where all that goes to. I'm wondering. Well, he had the girlfriend. Anybody up. I know, but she was the cover. She was like the beard. Yeah, that chick. Yeah, she was the beard. Oh, hell no, he ain't giving her shit. Well, he, he gave her. Million, he gave yeah. her like five hundred million dollars plus immu- immunity. Yeah, she. Oh, that's right. Huh? She she got immunity. Forever. Yeah, forever. Yeah, like, you're right. She did get immunity. Where is she right now? Yeah, yeah she, good question. She's in Europe. She got all those fucking. Is she? Hmm? She's probably with him. Exactly. Probably in Argentina because that's where everyone goes when they want to be safe. And his island might be like a who's going to pay to fly around that island, right? Yeah, I know. Any of the big media outlets going to? No, well, I mean that's a thing. Not right. if they're in his pocket. Here's the thing: if they really want to find out if he's still alive, the media, uh, some one of these fucking news companies is going to send somebody to. I'm, they don't, they're not going to care that they're for five years, ten years, whatever the fuck it is. To Once wait about. Yeah, once you get a picture, to send it over. I don't know, send but I think $5 billion is enough money to make you falsify your death. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's not less. Yeah. Let's it, say it, it is. $1 billion. Uh, Yeah, $1 billion. Is. Four. $1 billion. I think one $1 billion. billion. No, I, think. I would think. Yes. When you do that, when when you do that, it's not like it's not like you're buying the whole world out. No, no, you're just buying individuals out. Exactly. So at the end of the day, no matter what, people, there's still other people out there that can be like, "Fuck no, I didn't get paid shit. I'm and gonna fucking call him. Up. I'm gonna he call doesn't him." Up. Have to pay in currency. You know what I'm saying? What do you mean? Yeah. He has digital shit? evidence of certain situations in certain people. He has that enough evidence could be just disappear, like. The FBI raid of his New York place where they found servers uh, of sh- of child pornography and his fake yeah. passwords and shit like that. Yeah. That, are we who talking about, about Epstein or Nassar? No, Epstein. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Who knows? That was not yeah, that's the same shit with that guy. Dude. <laughs> call, no one knows who we're talking about this one. Like, yeah. But the thing is, is like that could have been. This guy or this guy or this guy or this guy. Yeah, that could have been the FBI basically recovering the Clinton's evidence. Let me ask you guys this. This is going to be a serious question. Yeah. Let me ask you guys this. Do you think this has to do anything with money? Money? What do you mean? Yeah, like, let's say... I think the whole thing is built on blackmail. 
Yeah. Well, yeah. I, and, the, and the, the reason, I, the, 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 the thing I'm saying is with money is like, you think if these guys didn't have money, they would still be doing the same shit. No, no, they wouldn't they have the caught. access. To they would have it. the ability to do it. They would have been caught and they would be in jail and they would have got stabbed. And okay, but that's what I'm saying. So whether they had money or not, they would still have yeah go on the same path. With people, to they're, they're, they're 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 molesters no matter what, whether yeah. they have money or not. Yeah. Just money gave them the you bigger the bigger whatever access ability to do it on a larger scale. Yeah, but ha- not yeah. having money, they would have still been. Molesters, they would have still done it. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah, no, Epstein would so, have fucking been rolled under the bus the first time he got caught. So, are you thinking that money? Were you trying to say that money? Yeah, the money changed him. Kyle, is that you? Yeah, the money changed him to like, okay, fuck, I got money now, I can do whatever the fuck I want, and and I and think, not worry about it. I think there might be an, an aspect to that, but I don't think. I think that comes down to the individual. Like, if you're if you're a damaged person that thinks that you have to do those kind of things or that you want to do those kind of things. Mm-hmm. You're gonna go down that avenue, but but if you're like a normal person, you just want to push the envelope and get like multiple chicks because you have the money or whatever, mm-hmm. then you're gonna do that. So I mean, I think it just depends on what you're gonna do with your your wealth. That's gonna... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So, 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 I think, so, so, so I think these individuals are fickle no matter what. Money yeah. just allowed them to do it on a bigger scale for a longer time without getting caught. For a longer time without getting caught. Which, like At Mark the said, end of the day, lie. I think it was all about power that's what i think it was oh for sure oh yeah he fed on that for sure yeah i mean because even, even uh, money this, comes everything else yeah power respect yeah sure what is that a hustler it maybe? is like, yeah it's a it's a rapper song hustle art uh, Anthem? This is yeah, fucking, no. what, what is that? What is that one guy that fucking does all the, the grind, the hustle that that artist guy does with the dollar bills and shit? First, you get the money, then you get the power, then you get the respect. So, okay. What are you talking about? You talking about Mark? Like he does, like the the art pieces that are like hustle grind. You know, oh, I don't uh, that company that does it. I don't know who the guy is. I know oh, what you're yeah. talking about. That does all the motivational stuff and everything. I don't know what you're talking about. I, I think it's more of a company than, than oh, a name okay. now. Uh, I think, honestly, dude, but I honestly think at the beginning, I remember this years ago, I think it was about that guy that did it or person, and now it's become a, a company. Big thing. Yeah, but they're bad. Hey, dude, yeah. we got to get, get some of those for the fucking office, bro. Yeah. In, in, in the rapper world. Nice, man. Yeah, not for here. In in the rapper world, it's it's you first you get the money. Yeah. Then you then get, you the, get power. the bitches. No, then you get oh, the, the, power, the power. The power. And then you get the respect. My bad. Yeah, look at Scotty being a rapper and shit. When do you get the bitches though? Once, once you have the power. Oh, okay. <laughs> it goes hand in hand, homie. I, I gotta fucking revamp my whole fucking yeah, business plan for my rap career. Turn over that pad and start writing <laughs> for my rap career. <laughs> out your resume. Ooh, here. So, um, is anybody watching? No, no one's watching right now. They're Paco could. Yeah, Paco and me? Joey. Uh huh. Paco I'm, and Joey. Okay. I'm, on, uh, I haven't responded to him, as you yeah. know. I, I'll I'll set it all up. Okay, Paco and Joey, Paco and Joe. Yeah, Paco and Joe Audio. They uh, posted on social media. They are trying to get dialogue with other podcasts about which one is superior: United States rap or UK rap. Well, we I, already, know, we, I know. We, is, is UK rap that big? I know UK yeah. rap. I know some UK rap, and they the are pretty streets. good. No, well, I mean obviously they're bringing that up for a reason. No, I know. Some. Well, we're we are talking about rap, so I'm gonna... so Albert doesn't know music. They're on Facebook promoting this, like trying to get some dialogue going. So I, I ended up posting somebody, uh, some random person posted like, "Oh, how, how do you determine what the difference is?" and yada yada, all this whatever. And Paco put out there that you know U.S. rap is. By far superior than you know any other rap or UK rap or anything like that. So I rebuttaled on social. Media. <laughs> of course you did. <laughs> so you're going on the UK side. Yeah, I was nice. like, did you look UK up some rap? Shit? A UK rap? Yeah. Well, I know of the streets. Of their oh, oh shit! shit. I want to yeah. check them out. I check them out. I like yeah. that. Okay. He's like he's, he's the streets? The UK. Oh, you once you 
pull him up and you see his most favorite, like you're not favorite, but his his most the song that got song. him famous. Yeah, you'll you'll uh, you'll know who he is. Um, yeah, I I did that and then what, I was like, yeah, don't you know the streets and and someone uh, somebody else and you, you from the streets. Yeah, I am from the streets. Am I? <laughs> The Farmer Street. Do you want to play any? <laughs> no. The Farmer Street. Uh, briefly. <laughs> like like a 10 second clip. Nothing yeah. that we can get shut down on YouTube for. Oh, we're going to get shut down, all right. But our views are up, dude. We just need to get the fucking um, the monetization thing. But I also want to see what what Joe Rogan's going to do with Spotify because maybe their video service is going to help podcasts out a little bit more. We'll see. You heard about the Joe Rogan thing, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah you, you've been talking about it for a while. Well, now that him and Joe uh, Coco are fucking in trouble, Joey Diaz. Oh, yeah. Because Joey was talking about, about that. How, yeah, that's another fucking. It's no, like I, I, I haven't heard of that. No, it's not. Joey no, it, Diaz. I mean, yeah. his his thing is more of like. It's more of a. Like a he told it's, a story. It's, it's, it's almost like a. Uh, Did you watch that video? No, but I know what it's about. But it, it's basically it's more of a. It's more of a Bill Cosby kind of thing where it's like, no, it wasn't. No it, one was I, drugged. I, I, no, no, I think mean, that's true. <laughs> But I'll give you. Th- I'll do this for you to get you here. Yeah. Or maybe it's more like a Weinstein. I'll so do this story, for you. I'll let, do. I'll me, get you no, this let job. Me, let, I'm sure every single podcast on under the podcast world is talking about this. But the story was. Let's see. What he said on Joe Rogan. This was like a decade ago. Like so, somebody went searching for this shit. But the story on the episode was, yeah, I used to fucking coerce girls. And uh, I'd be like, yeah, just suck my dick for some time on stage because he used to be the main guy at the comedy store in L.A. And who is this? Joey Joey Diaz. Diaz. Oh, shit, really? He was on a recent Netflix special uh, with Brad Williams and uh, Tom Segura's wife. Why can I not think of her name right now? That annoys me because I'm a fan. But either, either way, what what was it like the uh, the dis- disrespectfuls? No. Hold either on. way, sorry. Keep keep telling your story. I'll yeah. find out who that is. Yeah, yeah. So he tells a story to Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan is fucking rolling over, laughing over it. But he's like, "Yeah, I tell this girl, you know, you fuck suck my dick, and, and I'll get you some stage time in the main room, which he never was a host of the main room." of the comedy store he was a host of the belly room uh because the comedy store has like three or four different rooms segura's wife is christina powell wait joey diaz is that guy that actor he was in stuff yeah he's been in stuff he's, yeah, he's, been in stuff. he's, like, a, he's like a mobster guy yeah, 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 yeah. really he kind of <laughs> looks like uncle pussy yeah, that guy's mm-hmm. fucking he does kind of like uncle pussy yeah. Which it sounds a weird fucking thing to say. Oh, man. He sounds like my uncle pussy. <laughs> but <laughs> you, as, as all this was unfolding, though, uh-huh. uh, he comes out and starts telling. He basically tells everybody to fuck off because you, you can't take down someone that doesn't give a fuck. Which I, I am all about, hundred percent. But he he basically tells the actual story of what happens, and. Uh, the real story is is that she was there was someone that wanted stage time, and she had offered it to him, and he took he took it. Okay, so it's not, I mean it's still bad, but it's not as bad. But he's truthful about it. Yeah. But the thing is, is that no one's coming out saying that Joey Diaz is a bad person. Yeah, like everybody's behind him, comedians of all sorts, including females. <coughs> <clears throat> please, hey, can you please put on a mask? <laughs> but right now, oh, the street, there it is. All right. 
maybe we might need more than 10 seconds because it's a lot of my in, instrumentals. Who was that? This is the, the streets. Street. Oh, okay. Paco, when you listen to this episode, I know you will. <laughs> I will make this argument that he's better than Eminem. Wow, that's. Oh. Uh, well, the I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Oh, motherfucker, you're making it as a joke. Because I was say, you got to be fucking kidding me. I, I do. I, I think I, I get it, but I, I don't. Don't worry. Eminem. Eminem. No, he's shit, so much since, better. He's so since much we're better. talking about shit that yeah. pissing off other podcasts. <laughs> you are, dude. Nobody yeah, else no, no, You no, are. Play, play your yeah, fucking yeah. song. Play your CEO song. <laughs> I was like... Mark's like, since we are talking to no motherfucker, you are. Yeah, yeah, I, I fucked it up. You gotta get that shit on the loop. I don't, I don't know. Mark was doing it, but basically, so we think, okay. So <laughs> Every CEO should have this song, which is do, 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 do. When they come outside, like they come on to, to give they you relay bad news. They they give you the bad news, like, hey guys, we're gonna close this site. It's the CEO Tom Collins. I don't, that's not a CEO. That's a mixture, but whatever. I wish that was named that. Tom Collins, the CEO of is he? I don't know. Tom Collins. Tom. It's probably a fake name. Tom Collins, the CEO <laughs> of the Tom Collins mix, comes out and says, do 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 do. We don't Google shit around. We don't. Here. We don't give a shit. Uh, we're gonna close two breweries this week, and we love you guys. Here's some uh, eat up at the food and head home. Do 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 do. We think every CEO should have. So that they was, should. It's a it's basically a clown song for <laughs> for every CEO making their decisions. <laughs> no, we, we make to give uh, context. We make. You know, well, I'm, I make friends with the podcast industry, right? That is true. You Not do. industry. Do uh, you? Peace, peace. Yeah. Uh, we officially have gotten into a beef with another podcast. Oh, who? One we've actually been on and took over. Small oh, top mentality. Is ben mad at us? You guys were, yeah. Why is Ben mad at us? Well, that's, it, dude, it's not our fault that you don't show up. I can't, I can't not. <laughs> I can't force you to show up. And Albert, I appreciate you showing up. I miss you. I love you. <laughs> what the fuck are you guys talking about? But Mark's right. Yeah. <laughs> you liking my sugarcoat answer to, to give that? <laughs> I don't I don't agree with Mark, but I, I understand what he's saying. I love you, Mark. <laughs> I don't give a fuck what Mark says, dude. Um, How about that? Yeah. yeah no, I think I, Mark I don't pretty much took over. <laughs> Hey, why, why am I here to delay? Hold on, hold on. Yeah, listen, listen, know. listen. He doesn't really help me out either. Dude, the, the, <laughs> the um, uh, network, yep. Twitter, and Instagram are probably the most neglected things I have. You know, I've got so much shit. <laughs> That's don't... why I decided to just do my little independent thing and not have to worry about all that. No offense to you. you got a great thing going, but... um. It I, was um, just so much to keep up with, man, and try good. to focus on yeah, my own really show and, you know, and keep up with everything else. And now I'm balls deep in shitty song of the week. <laughs> podcast, <laughs> oh, Patreon, so we're trying to come up with uh, <laughs> yeah. for that. I didn't text Balls me. deep. So yeah. It was just better. It was just better for me to just, you know, do my own thing. Who's this? Doing Patreon for shitty song of the week, or yeah. this is uh, a so- small town mentality. Yeah, yeah Ben uh, and uh, what's, who's his who's his partner? Ben shitty and, song of the week. Well, his week. his partner is Randy, but Randy. he didn't show up this week when they we started moved just talking just shit. A podcast over to that's Randy talking right there. We're, um, we're doing like a dishonorable mentions. We're, we're, we're trying to find the actual clip. Shitty song of the week, and then we're doing uh, additional segment is all the podcast genres so we're recording six or seven six or seven extra bonus ah never mind i'll find it so anyway so just give it a give us in context what happened 
Yeah, what, what, basically, what basically they're they're for? talking shit because he wanted to start a podcast beef. Oh, that's the only reason. Yeah, I I didn't even like. I mean, that's I, fine. We can do that. Yeah, oh, oh, he, he wanted to start it with us. Albert, Albert, I, no, Albert, that, yeah, no, no, no. So hold on, hold on. Thing. Fuck it, Albert. Say something in Spanish and make him mad. Hey, wait, but then I better go say. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Timon, eh? Oh, I'm gonna get pissed off once he figures out what it is. All right. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys want beef, right? Yeah, West All Coast, right, well, Middle Coast. It. Well, there you go. They're in where they're in. I didn't figure that out. They're in Wyoming. Now they're gonna have beef. Idaho, Idaho, oh, Wyoming. No, Wyoming. Okay, Wyoming. So let me ask you this. Okay, so who who wanted to start beef? Ben from Small Town Mentality. You want with to- us? No, I yeah. Think, well, he yeah. he was putting it out there to try to start talk shit to other podcasts, but I accepted the challenge. You know, you okay. know, you know so what happened. So what happened? Okay, so you accepted the challenge. What happened? Paco. Well, he was talking shit on his last episode. He basically said, "Fuck the amigos." Oh shit! Why did you tell yeah. me this, dude? Go well, it just go. started. I mean, it, I, go Spanish on him. <laughs> oh shit! Don't ask I don't know. Well, yes, me, me, cerveza, yo. Oh no, I don't know. I got, I got, I got to listen to these guys first, and then yeah. listen to their last episode. Okay, all right. They're, just, good, they're, they're like near the end, though. They're so good. Dude. They must have been drunk. Also, but no. it's towards the end. Yeah, it's near the end. So just right, you nice. know, be like, um, you know what? Just don't listen to their show. It's fucking garbage. <laughs> burn. Not burn. Just, and not just the show. Yeah. Don't <laughs> give them the privilege of a listen. All right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, no, that's, seriously, that's... don't. However, if you want to check out more small town mentality, check out the Amigos PC at <laughs> <laughs> We have some episodes with those guys when yeah. You've been on their show. You you been on their show. And we uh, and actually we made, their, we, made we, like them. we actually made their show. <laughs> <laughs> You're good guys. We like them, but fuck them. Um, and guess what? And I wasn't even there. And we no, made their show. So it's like that, oh, that, that, that right there. That right there tells you how good their show is. So we one made time, their show, and I wasn't even there. So one what? time. Once uh once we get off the air though, I just I, I do want to talk about the next couple weeks. So just Oh, what does that mean? Up. No, no. I'm Mark's just... going to jail. Shit. Yeah, I'm going to jail. <laughs> so he had to do it from uh <laughs> <out of> computer, <laughs> <in> computer <laughs> county. Yeah. Here's my keys. I, I can't fucking be on anymore. <laughs> okay, guys. So uh I'm give you access to uh recording and all that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the passwords. <laughs> <laughs> here's, here's here's the booties I've been wearing. Why do you wear booties? Here are the passwords. Uh, I'm gonna give you guys access to be able to record this stuff and see it. Hey, uh, I have those uh, light bulbs up there. I have them uh, locked up. So here's the here's the key to unlock them. <laughs> the light bulbs. <laughs> and the the yeah, he's got. Yeah, I got the light switches on a timer and shit. So here's the light. Here's the, here's the code. I, I love I love That's the fact, so I love the fact that Albert said the perfect thing a couple of weeks ago. When, what is that? When we it was obviously it was off when we were off mic or whatever, but oh. he goes the thing I love about Mark is he doesn't always, like to pay for shit. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. That's true. I love it, dude. I love that shit. You, do you remember saying that? Yes, I do. Okay, yeah, yeah. We, were talking, we were talking about our other business. I believe you did. I believe yeah. you did. We were talking about our other business, and we were talking about, it's like, okay, we got to take care of shit, but at the yeah. same time, it's like, I, I I don't like paying for shit, but I do not like asking for it. I love yeah, how Mark, Mark, Mark doesn't like Mark paying for shit. So oh, I was like, I love that part. You're on a, you're on a hot mic, sir. Uh, <laughs> can, you, can you tell us who you are and what you do? I drive. You drive. Who's that? Jim? Uh, you told me something about uh, an investor was maybe going to meet me up here. Oh yeah. yeah. Shh, shh. Don't don't talk talk about the. You're oh. on the live mic right now. No no work talk. Is yeah. Work talk. Uh, is that Jeff? Yeah, it's Jeff. Uh, what's up, Jeffy? <laughs> Jeffy. G- oh, I'm sorry, Jiffy. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, what's up, Jiffy? <laughs> Jiffy, Lou? oh you can't hear Edward. <laughs> oh, you can't hear me. No, he. Can't. 
<laughs> oh, that's amazing. That only has a yeah. Yeah. What's up, error. Disney? You're going to have to go back and listen to this, Albert. Or, I, I think I do. After your fucking laugh right there. Not you, what... not you, no. You need... Jeff not, needs to. No, what, why Jeff? Because he can't oh, hear what you're saying. Oh, that's right. Jeff, oh, he can't. He has to listen because you know what's going on. So what's up, dude? Beyond, don't talk work, though. What? Uh, yeah, just, leave. Back. just leave. Okay. Do you think? Okay, hold on, Jeff. What time is it? When did you get there, Jeff? Do you think Epstein was right in what he did or not? Well, uh, what did Jeff get get to? I he's he's that. been in a uh, Sheboygan today. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Was oh, it your cousin? No, it's my brother. My brother. Same thing. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Same thing. Same thing. Either brother or cousin. Same thing. (laughs) No, that makes sense. I'm white as well, sir. (laughs) Same difference. Like three quarters white. Three quarters white. I'm more white, so I can say that. (laughs) Motherfucker, you can say anything you want, can you? Well, I I can't I, I can't say that to you and to myself, but that's it. This motherfucker, is, it's got it's like oh, it's racist. He's like, oh no, I can't. I can say that. <laughs> oh, sexy! Ooh, we got we got pics, dude. Oh, Uploaded nudes. Send some pics, buddy. <laughs> All right. For can, you, can you tell me? Can you tell me why it's vacant? Is there? Is there one? Are, are you on the surfboard on one? What? I want him on it's a surfboard. Va- it's vacant. I thought it was yeah. Acrobat. No, the Sheboygan one's vacant. Really? Yeah, yeah. we're talking shop. We should start finishing. Oh, yeah. up. How okay. long have we been? Almost an hour. An hour. Actually, an hour. Yeah. It's longer than that. No, it's been an hour. So, you, oh, like- Jeff, you can't tell how it's been vacant or why. Uh, You've been dodging this question for like a couple days, so I'm trying to figure out why. How many people died in the house? All right, let's talk about this offline. Yes, let's All right. finish up. All right, let me call you back in like uh, 10, 15 minutes. I'll sit in front of the house and wait. Yeah. No, don't sit in front of the house. You can just go. Put your shirt on. Yeah, Jeff, Jeff, put your shirt on. Oh, you're on a motorcycle? <laughs> oh. Jeff, put your shirt on. Okay, give me like 10, 15 minutes and, then. And put your shirt on. Put your shirt on. <laughs> Make sure you wear a helmet. He's, no, he's fuck, on his motorcycle no, right now. No, fuck that. That's gay. Oh. No. <laughs> whoa, it could, it whoa, could be. It could whoa. be gay. I don't know. Oh, look at you. It's your fucking Calm down. That's the acceptable one. I don't know. I don't know either. Pick a letter. <laughs> the one I want to go with, I'm going to go with the one I said before. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'll call you in a couple minutes. All right. Bye. Love you. Heart you. Bye. Oh, it's only two thirty, huh? Damn. I don't know. Why, I don't know why it seems like yeah. it's like fucking eight or nine o'clock at night. Because we've been. Because you. You're like fucking eighteen margaritas deep. Uh, <laughs> Mary, Mary, Mary. No, because I guess we always do it late. It's oh, that's true. Yeah, with that's true. we do it at one in the afternoon. By twelve well, o'clock, I was like, oh it's shit. Sunday is different. Yeah. yeah it w- well. I mean, kind of late for Delvin. Yeah, for him, it was five o'clock for him almost. Somewhere. (laughs) It's five o'clock somewhere. Is that a song? (laughs) That's a horrible song. That's a horrible song. I think so. I'm going to have to check out this uh, best of Joey Diaz that you just shared. Oh, holy shit. He's got my gut. (laughs) Yeah, that shit was funny, huh? Yeah. That's why I sent it. All right, so let's finish up. I, I, right, I, had, que- I had questions for Dalvin Cox, but I'm going to say them to you, Albert, since you're our guest. Uh-oh, what the fuck? Welcome, hey, shut your face. Welcome to the show. Albert, well, so, here, so here's my five-question rapid thing for Dalvin that we'll do with Dalvin. Hopefully he doesn't see it because I, has, I, I might have to revamp it. Either way, what games have you been playing during the COVID situation on lockdown? I'm 45 years old, bro. I don't play That's games. Zero. Okay. 2020, worst year. <laughs> you 2020, 2020, worst year of your life. Yes or no? 
What's that? No, one one of the best years business wise. <laughs> one of the best years of my life. Okay, cool. Twenty twenty. Good for you. Uh, we got to bleep that out. Yeah. Mandatory mask wearing. Yes or no? Optional. Optional. That's a that wasn't an answer, but oh, I'll take it. Um, buy Yeezy from the Gap. Yes or no? That's no, a, that's a Kanye Kanye Yeezy by the Gap. No. No. That's Kanye West. Kanye West is now Kanye. at the Gap. Yeah. Which you oh, look, really hope you yeah. find a Gap. Yeah. No. Go around. Are they have your sizes in the kids' gap. Have is, that, is that his wife, like, like between his wife's legs, like a gap? No, there's no, there's no <laughs> gap. There, there is a gap. His wife's there, legs. There, yeah. I, I think there's a gap. She probably got Oh, that there's shirt. definitely a fucking she's, gap. She's got, <laughs> there's always a gap. There's always a gap there. Are you, are you still crazy during the COVID lockdown situation? Yes or no? No. Well, the fucker's on the street no. more than anybody I know. Will sports yeah. happen this year? Yes or no? Yes. Which one? Football, at least. You think football will happen? Yeah. Didn't, so nothing else. Didn't you just um? Oh, no, I, th- I think I think Major League Baseball is going to happen. I think soccer is going to happen. I think a lot. Of they them just are had happen. the national championship of um the beanbag one. Cornhole. Cornhole. Yes. Yeah. National champ. It was television live on NBC this recent. Oh my god! I was yeah, gonna it's going to happen. I mean, UFC is doing it on still. That was a good, good they fight are last on. night. Yeah, they're on. Yeah, yeah. Was a good last night. I was thinking the main three, like basketball, football. Yeah, basketball. Yeah, I think basketball. that's still going to happen. Yeah. So you think football will happen? Nothing else? Yes. Yeah, no, 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 no. I think some other ones are going to happen. I'm right just saying now? That. Well, no, no, no. I'm just talking are about... You asking me, are you asking me which one's next? Or what are you asking? Baseball's just, next. Just, well, that's what they say, but right now everything's spiking up. and People are getting yeah. sick. I think football, happening. baseball, basketball, up. all those are going to happen. All the major league ones are going to happen. They have the infections. I think all the major league ones are going to happen. Like the Phillies, there's like 20 members that are sick. Because they all okay. those. Go, are, go on. on. Spring training. <laughs> there's people that are sick. Yes, I agree. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I agree. There are people sick. <laughs> and that's how that works. Yes. <laughs> But I, I think, I think, yeah. If anything, football happens. I don't think anything else. No, I think baseball is going to happen. Yeah, baseball happens. You think yep. so? Yeah. Six, Sixty games. Yeah. yeah. No, that's, that's what they said. That's what going to happen. I don't. I don't even think like the first when baseball originated here in America. Like I don't think there was sixty games. Yeah, because the steam fucking train can only go one at a time. Yeah. yeah. That's a difference. <laughs> This is a new world. So but stop th- adding games. But I think if you can test people before they get on the planes and they're positive, then go home. Or like fever, go home. Then maybe don't go on the plane and then you can play. And- let, me, let me ask everyone right now. Do you know of someone firsthand that's I love, been... I love how you said it that way. That's been... Tested positive or has it? Yes, no. I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. You don't, though. Yes, I, I do. do. Okay. I know you're going to go this way <laughs> because we, you've been saying things, <laughs> and I, and I saw her six months ago. Okay, and I saw him as well six months ago. Six months ago. Yeah. Okay. But and now my thing is, she's on a ventilator. Have okay. My thing though is, is did, did okay. There she is. She's in a hospital, right? Yeah. Okay. She went to the hospital with symptoms, and they threw I don't, her I on. Have no, I don't did know. Did they the actually details. test her and get results back? I don't know the details. That yeah. To me, that's still secondhand. I, I know you. No, I agree. Them. I agree. I agree. That's I, not I, firsthand. He, so, okay, Within so, arm's so in, distance. In context, so let me tell you what happened. So my, so everyone knows. Everett's like, mm-hmm. shut up, shut up, shut up. Yeah. My, <laughs> no, my, a roommate that I had 10 years ago, <laughs> his wife has COVID. And oh, she, yeah, you were telling us about that. She's, yeah. yeah and she's, she's on a ventilator here in Arizona. Uh-huh. And I found that out from... The other roommate that I had, so I had two, three, well, me and two other roommates at the time. So it's even third hand now at this point, because you didn't hear it directly from the source. No, I did not. So 
So you think I'm lying? No, I'm not saying that. I, you're I don't know. At all. I mean, I'm just saying. I'm, I'm not saying that. I'm just it, saying that I know this person. Yeah. And I saw him six months ago. Yeah. And I saw his wife there six months ago. Yep. And we were at a thing at a high school event where they were working mm-hmm. there. And that was the last time I saw them. And I've talked to them a couple times since then to have poker with us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they were going to come to that poker event mm-hmm. when we were going to have it in March. And they were going to get through. COVID. No, she didn't have it then. She wasn't going to come. It was going to be him. It be for cold COVID. And, Pre-COVID. And, then, and, then, and then I find out that, that she has it. And then I text him. I said, hey, man, like, let me know whatever you need. Because that sucks. Because you imagine, like... Your wife or someone, you know, maybe even a cousin in the ICU, and you couldn't see that person because they're on a ventilator because you can't go in there and see them. And hopefully they make it through. If not, they die. Yeah. Like, that's, that's fucking crazy. It is crazy. So that's, that's my only connection. There's other people that we know that have had it in, like, Washington. Cousins. That you know of? Yeah, that we know of. Like, okay. I guess in Mark's calculations, second removed. Yeah. Versus third removed, second removed because Same I know head. these people. And these are my wife and, mother, <laughs> and the whole family. Second removed, they all had it. The only one that had it that was bad was was the 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 father who had it, and he had diabetes, and it was worse for him versus the other three. So him, it was a struggle, and she had to manage. She got it, and the, they had two kids. And she had to take care of the two kids while he was struggling to get through it. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. First was hand, first hand, someone that you deal with daily, right? No, I have not. Okay, how about you, Albert? First hand. Okay, so so um, <sighs> first hand would be your fucking house. It would be your house. Yeah, I, I, you, I, you have com- communicate like it's someone that you okay, know. So, to- uh, uh, that you no, talk to on a regular. Okay, so my, my my daughter talks to her cousin in Washington, and she was she went she to the it. hospital and they tested no, her yes. positive. She had she had it. Well, the husband but had in it Washington, first. not here. Yeah, okay. not here. Go ahead, Albert. Sorry. I mean that's bullshit. You guys have a question, and then you fucking blow me off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, say in Spanish, Mark. Go ahead. So you okay. Know. <laughs> So no, I mean not that, that personally. Supposedly, some of my uncles and back in California. That was a bad way to, that was a bad way to present that. Like, so, uh, like happened, are you fucking kidding me, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Shut Just up go. For like a tell, minute. Are you fucking <laughs> kidding me, bro? You ask me a question and you fucking interrupt me, bro. Are you are, are you done, Scotty? I'm done. Thank you. Sorry. <laughs> for a minute. <laughs> okay, so so supposedly my uh my uncle in uh in California have had it, but they're over over it. My daughter was sick for about two months, about a month, but she went to go get tested. Here, she went to go get tested. Yeah, here, but she went to go get tested, but they never gave her results. Uh, but all she had was just the fever. The fever. Um. Let me see. But she, but she stayed quarantine. But she stayed quarantined for about you know uh, over two weeks. Okay. Yeah. Um, let me see. But besides that, um, sad, to, sad to say, my grandmother just passed away uh, last Saturday. Oh. Uh, but she was. Do she, she was about. See, and that's the thing is like like I was saying, my uncles saying that they were sick. She, she was already ninety years old. So she was already like not in the best shape either. Um, so she, you know, so so they, they honestly, dude, they can't really say it was from COVID. It was just basically she was older, um, and uh, they get a cause. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, that's yeah exactly. But like, obviously, but I, I guess what I bet you they're gonna say it was COVID. COVID related. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Like, yeah. Exactly. So they had it in a ventilator at the end and everything. So they're gonna fucking blame it on COVID. She's gonna get it. Yeah. Exactly. So, um, you know, so that's about the closest that I've had. She she lived in Somerton, right? No, no, my grandma lives in uh, Calexico, next to El Centro. Oh, okay. Okay. California. 
I'm sorry for your loss. Well, thanks, but well, appreciate the it. Odd man out now because I don't have anybody directly that has tested positive. So Mark positive thinks it's fake. Or... So you think it's fake? COVID? Yeah, I think it's true. I think they're. All, I think they're, they're. I think personally, they're uh, blowing it out of. You know, don't like, work on the swine flu. Yeah, I think, yeah, exactly. I think the only thing that that worries me personally is like people that has respiratory issues. Which I do. My son does. That's what scares me. Yeah. He has asthma. That worries me. Like, I can't. He's I the can't. only one. If I get it and unfortunately die, I love you guys. Yeah. But if I did, I mean, whatever. But for him, I don't want that to happen to him. Like, hopefully, I, he's young enough to fight it off. Yeah. But with my respiratory things, like, I what can't. What do you have? Do you have asthma or something like that? I don't know. I've never been diagnosed. I, I, I have the fear of going to a doctor to get diagnosed. Um, yeah, that's a bad sign, but go ahead. I know. It's <laughs> <laughs> a bad start. Yeah. Yeah, but, yeah, that's a bad sign, but go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, Albert <laughs> has witnessed it firsthand. Uh, when, like when I had moved, when I had moved, like, uh, you know, heavy lifting, things like that, and, and pushing things into, like, I got to take a second to breathe uh, after moving something fairly heavy. Yeah. Um, that could just be me being out of weight, but it, at the same time, I can't run <laughs> long distances without like taking some serious, you know, breath, deep breaths, trying to breathe, you know, so, things like that. So, yeah. uh, but when I was a teenager, dude, I, I was always on the bike. So it's, it's weird at, uh, as to how things are, but I, like, I, 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 I think can, it might I be, I can feel it in, in, in the chest, like tighten it up. Yeah, oh, gotcha. yeah, yeah, you gotta work at that. I know, I gotta work at that. Which, which, which is, which I gotta is, go to yeah. the you gotta work out. <laughs> that, that's obviously that's, that'd, be, that'd be plan A, but what I mean is you should probably start doing stuff, working out, which is me too. Like, the whole <laughs> the COVID shit, right? It's fucked yeah. up. I want to go to the gym, I do, but I, I don't know if I should or not. Yeah. I think I don't know. Like Mike's been going. Me too. Problems. Yeah, perfect thing. You been yeah, going? They, they don't ask you. They don't. Uh, well, no, at least not on Planet Fitness. Where do you, they don't, where do you go? Planet, Planet Fitness. Fitness. They don't ask you to put it, it on. Mask up, I imagine, right? Huh? No, she doesn't put a mask on either. Yeah, that's something they don't ask you to put it on. It's required. I'd be hard. No, it's required. Hard. Obviously, it's not. Let's continue to hang out, but let's cut this down. No, and, no, and, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna leave. Fuck leave this. You're gonna cut me short. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Oh, going. Good, keep the conversation going. Is that's what the name I'm of the saying, episode. Cut me fuck, short. Fuck, fuck you. Mark's like, cut the, I mean, keep the conversation going, but let's just cut you off live. <laughs> I mean, I'm not trying to be harsh, but no one wants yeah. to hear you <laughs> anymore, Scott. <laughs> pretty much. That's what you're saying. Pretty much. Yeah, hey, you. nobody wants to hear what the fuck you're saying. No, it's. I want to hear your bullshit, Scott. But I, not everybody. Yeah, not but everybody. Not everybody. Thanks, Mark. Right. Thanks. Amigos out. Look at this guy fucking PC in me. <laughs> Look at my dude. No, 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 no. We want to hear what you're saying. Just not everybody wants to hear what not, you're saying. No one wants to hear it. Just, <laughs> just me. Yeah. Take it. We're still live, by the way. I know. This has been the Amigos PC. Make sure to like, subscribe, and review us on all your podcasting platforms. Visit us at AmigosPC.net for our entire library of content and Amigos merch. Till next time, adios.